What inspires you? It's difficult to explain, isn't it? While inspiration is such a dynamic, totally intangible thing, it's also something that seems so critical to making art, although it's nothing without hard work. People have asked me to talk about what inspires me. I suppose it's the same general things that inspire other people. Things like beauty, strength, especially in adversity, grand perspectives, underdogs, overcomers, powerful restraint, emotion on the edge, righteous anger, heartbreak, enormous effort, sublime visions, glory turned to desolation, the innocence of youth, multitudes acting in unison, the simple allure of nature, the mindless power of the ocean, the human body, lilting melodies, haunting harmonies, perseverance, love. You know what I'm saying. There are a lot more than I have listed here. You know what inspires you. These things can be experienced in a variety of ways. Obviously, the most powerful would be through personal involvement. The things you go through, the things that happen to you and around you, have the biggest potential to be inspiring to you. That said, some of these things you will have no control over, no input on whether or not these things happen. On the other hand, you can decide to put yourself in situations where you know something will be more likely to inspire you. I don't want to list off any specific activities because they are different for everybody, and you have to find them for yourself. Other, less powerful, but still effective ways to witness inspiring things include watching movies, listening to music, looking at art, reading books, so on and so forth. These are basically second-hand inspiration, the results of other people being inspired. But that's not bad. If it works, it works. And sometimes it works very well. Often the inspiration you get from these sources will resonate with something that has happened to you in your life, and an altogether more profound and powerful inspiration will take over you. Also, of course, there are probably a myriad of examples in all these categories that won't inspire you at all. At the end of the day, inspiration is a concept that is tough to nail down. Obviously, it's different for everyone, so take what I've said here with a grain of salt. There will be times in your life when you don't feel inspired at all, and it will be frustrating. This is inevitable. Whatever you do, don't give up. Do what you can to get through these tough times. Worst case scenario, try using the frustration you feel as inspiration to carry on. You can do it. You will make it.